What up guys, this is Friend Relations with my first video that's not a Nike SB video. This is going to be on my big and ice cream collection. Um, I actually don't have room for these in my room, so this is the hallway leading to my room, but yeah. So let's get started. Um, the Psychic Camo Stones. Really nice colorway. It's got the little um, Psychic Camo Ape. Wore these pretty often with my uh, February calendar tea from I we'll say like 06, I'm not sure, maybe it was 07. <clears throat> then, these were actually my first Babestas, the Halloween Frankensteins, little Frankenstein ape on the back. Really dusty and dirty, not wearing that often anymore. The gold and silver snakeskin uncles. It's pretty cool how on the back it says one of a hundred. And each of the shoes have their own little design stitched into them. Next we're getting into the Roadsters. Got the red camo Roadsters with the red camo and the air bubble. And the plaid Roadsters with the plaid camo and the um, air bubble. For a lot of us this is the closest we'll get to the Kanye Stas. Then the SpongeBob Roadsters threw the red laces on them. Got SpongeBob on the back and the sponge print and the air bubble. Alright, this next one's like hands down my favorite colorway from Bape in general, like on the Roadster or on the Bapesta, the AMPM colorway. Really nice, love these, wore them a lot. And also a very similar colorway, the LA Camo um, Roadsters. Babe was actually like what first got me into shoes, so a lot of these are really beat. I wore them a lot, including my Pharrell's. Got scratches on the back, creases in the front. But yeah. Next we have the Gold Roadsters. And the Milo and Friends does. And then I have two versions of the, or two colorways, I should say, of the creeps. The coffee one. Not sure what this colorway is called. Two colorways of the 88s. This red one was one of the original colorways, and this is one of the slightly newer ones. But I think they did a really good job with the 88s. I like a lot of the ones that were released. They put back there, the, the big star on the back. Really dope. BBC Boat Shoe from, I believe, last season. It's got, or maybe it was like Yacht Shoe, I forgot. It's got the little. Yeah, on the inside. Then, some vape sandals. These are really comfortable. And although this isn't vape or BBC, the clot times visvin. Really nice. And then I'm pretty sure you can see back there. I also have a lot of board flips on the floor and stuff. Uh, I got those near the end of when um, they were producing them, so the malls had them on sale for like 10 bucks each. So as you can see, I have a lot of colorways. They're all very similar, but for 10 bucks, I can pass them up. I believe the retail on them was 80. I want to say there's only two that I bought for retail, which were one of the last pairs I got, the red ones. These are actually the yellow laces from the SpongeBob's, and then I just put these red laces on the SpongeBob's. And lastly. <coughs> The first pair I got, which I ended up wearing the most, I just liked it because it was like an unusual colorway, but it worked so well. I used to wear it with my um, baby blue tiger hoodie because it had the blue and the orange on it. And then to show you one of the bottoms of the board flips had the ice cream cone. So yeah, that's my um, bait and ice cream collection. I'll at some point get to showing you guys my Jordans and my random Nikes. And all the other 
random brands of shoes. But yeah, this is Fran Relations. Don't forget to rate, subscribe, and comment. And I'll see you guys next time.